Hi guys, thank you for watching. Welcome to another episode of Home Gardening. In today's video I want to show you how I pack my plants, how I prepare them for shipping and also I will teach you how to pack your tree so that it can be delivered to a new owner successfully and without damaging. So if you guys are interested please keep watching. Well, truly to say, this is my favorite part. You know, I like to care about the plants and also I like doing something by my own hands. So, okay, let's get started. As you see, this particular plant is rather small. So we have no problems with packing it, the first thing I always do when I started packing is to cover the soil. You can hurt your plant, you can damage it or even the plant can be broken. So what I always do, I take a cardboard from packages that was sent to me and cut around rods of a form of a pot. In my case, I have a plastic cup. How I do it is I just take the same cup, the same plastic cup, and do the next way. Okay, so now we have the image. Take scissors. Here we have. As you see, it is completely of a size of our pot or plastic cup. The next step before you cover the soil, you have to check if the soil of your plant is not dry. In my case, the soil is a little bit dry so do not forget to water it so okay after watering your plant I take my round rod and make an incision so that you can insert the stem of your tree in it of how I do this. After I've cut it, I covered the soil of my plant. like this and then I fix that all with a scotch tape
Okay, the first part is done. As you can see now our plant is fixed and the soil won't come out of the pot. Everything is good. And now let's move to the second part of our packaging. Okay, now we fixed our plant and it is a very important step how to fix the whole plant. You must be aware of it because our delivery services can do different things with our packages you really can't imagine. Well, me too. So, for a small plant like this, I use two more plastic cups and do the next. Well, I take a plastic cup and just cut the bottom part of it. And after I've cut the bottom part, I put it on my plant. Like this. and fix this part also with a scotch tape. We have something like this, but it's not the end yet. Then we take another plastic cup and also cut off the bottom part of it. And then put it on our plant again. After I put this plastic cup on my plant, I <clears throat> drag it a little inside, as you can see, and now also fix it with a scotch tape. Okay, now we've done it. So now, after I did all this, as you can see, my plant is not covered. So that I take a cardboard once again, put a plastic cup on it, take my pencil 
and do the same again one more time. We have it. And cut the round circle again. We have it. Now put it on the top of our plant. If everything is okay, the next step is very important. Do not forget to spray your plant with water so the plant have some humidity in there. Take a sprayer and spray a little with water. Then take our cardboard circle and what is the next step? Yes, you're right! <laughs> Fix it with a scotch tape! <laughs> So, as you see, I pack my package with the utmost care and also I have a great success in shipping plants like this. And now let's move to our another part. It will be on about how to make a wrapping, how to wrap this thing. It will be a little DIY on my channel. Thumbs up if you like this. So, let's get started! So guys, I've made a cardboard box, um, a wrapping for my citrus tree. And now I just want to show you how it everything works. First of all, make the bottom part of my box. I will wrap it with a scotch tape, then this part also wrap with a scotch tape, then put it like this. And put my plant in it. Cover it also like this. Also wrap it everything with a scotch tape and and yeah and our packaging is ready. I will do it out of camera guys and then I'll show you the final result. Stay tuned. So guys as you can see I made my wrapping out of camera. It looks like this. Everything is fine and my package will be safe in it. Now the next step, I will put the address somewhere here 
all of course I will do it out of camera because it's private address and yeah thank you for joining me on this episode of home gardening I really appreciate that hope you find this video helpful for you and we will meet again in my next video bye bye